All new this morning, Discover Arkansas is back with a new series and a new travel guide. Now, in case you missed the news, Adam Bledsoe is back on THV 11 to co-host The Vine with Ashley King, but he's also taking us to amazing destinations in our great state. Today, he is taking us back to where it all started. I'm back. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. I thought I'd come to the very first place I ever discovered working for THV 11. Back in 1930, this place was discovered. Is it... Pettigene State Park? No, 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 but we're not too far away from Pettigene. Ladies and gentlemen, we're at Mount Nebo State Park. We're going to rediscover that today. I understand we haven't seen it all. Let's go discover this place. Y'all with me? Come on. Who could ever forget this amazing overlook? It's known as the Bench Overlook. Y'all go check this place out. So Mount Nebo State Park is about an hour and 15 minutes from downtown Little Rock. It's a very easy drive just outside of Dardanelle. You know that you can come right up to Mount Nebo. It's known for lots of things, beautiful sunrises, beautiful sunsets. It's time for dad jokes. I look like a lumberjack. I know this looks like a lumberjackie. Yeah, that's right, it's Jackie Rupp with Arkansas State Parks. She is the lead superintendent person up here. No, not quite. I'm the park interpreter. That's right. Park interpreter right above the superintendent. So they respond to you. Uh, absolutely not really, though. Oh, OK, OK, OK. Well, we need to get that straight right now. Jackie, I remember you interpreting the park for us yes. in the past. Mm -hmm. What do you have to show us this time around? I've got a couple of waterfalls that I'm really excited to take you to. I've got a hiking trail that I want to take you on and then a bike trail that I want to take you to. Are we going to bike? Not today. Okay, we're going to do that some other time though. Absolutely. All right, let's go check this out. All right, Jackie, so where are we right now? We are at the Waterfall Trailhead. And is this something, uh, do you take people down here on a regular basis? I sure do. I do guided hikes when the waterfall is running. So Jackie, what uh, could we expect if we come on a guided tour with you? Oh, we would definitely talk about the waterfall itself, we would enjoy it and maybe uh, talk about all our trees. So be sure to wear proper uh, shoes because it can be a little bit slippery. Now, when is the best time to see the waterfall? In the spring, usually. Uh, after it rains, it's really bad about drying up. So if you can come right after a rain, you've got the best chance of seeing it. You know, Arkansas is quickly becoming known as a mountain bike destination, whether it's northwest Arkansas, down in Hot Springs, or here at Mount Nebo State Park. There are 25 miles of mountain bike trails, 12 miles of hiking trails. So whether or not you're wanting to come out here and discover this place for their beautiful waterfalls, or maybe enjoying a s'more by the campfire with your family, this is a great place to come discover. Get out there and discover this place and go discover Arkansas. Such a beautiful spot, not too far away from Little Rock. I've been to Mount Nebo a time or yep. two with friends, family. Yep. It's just something you do if you're from here. It's just something you do, especially if you go to Arkansas Tech. I did. <laughs> you always cross the river uh, and hit up Nebo. It's just a beautiful location. You can see well off to the west. You can see Magazine. If you look off to the east, you can see Petty Jean. A uh, great little area. We have some friends there. THB 11 has some mm. friends there. Uh, Cynthia, she lives right on top of Nebo. And it doesn't matter if it's storming, it's snowing, a beautiful sunrise. She always shares us the photos and they're my favorite photos to get. When I see Cynthia's name pop up, I know it's Taking that beautiful. One. Yeah, uh, great place in the park interpreters. Man, they just know so much about these parks. You go to Nebo and you just learn so much about it. What's so amazing too is when you talk to them, I mean, human encyclopedias. Yes. If you have a question, they have an answer immediately. It's like, where that rock was, oh, that was formed in uh, 1732. This was moved here for That's this right. reason. And That's they right. just know it They all. know it and, and it's just fascinating. Uh, Nebo is a good place to check out.